What's going on my beautiful people from YouTube? I want to talk to you guys about three mineable projects that I don't want you to miss out on. And it's not a deeper network. Since my last video was on the deeper network and I'm giving away the deeper connect Pico on this video, I want to make sure you guys hear about other projects as well. And on Twitter, I asked you guys a few questions in regards to what you wanted the next giveaway to be. So um, I'll give you guys the option between the Bobcat, the Sense Cap, and the you know, since Edge Mini by Kaisera. Drop a comment down below so that I know exactly what mineable token you guys are excited about. That's how you entered the giveaway for one of these great products that I just showed you. Now, more on those giveaways at the end of the video, but let's get right into this whole thing about what should you mine? What should you be looking into right now? Um, these are projects that I'm actually personally involved in, things that I have my own money into, and I mean, I'm not going to tell you guys what to do ever. I'm sharing with you what I am doing. And all I ask in return is for you guys to, you know, smash the like button for the YouTube algorithm and make sure that more people find the channel. And I'm so appreciative that we're at 19,000 subscribers so far. So thank you so very much for that. It is just incredible to, to see the growth of this channel, even when I slack off and don't post videos for a little while. The flu, sorry guys. But let's get right into the first one. And I might get a little bit of slack on this, but it's helium. Um, helium is at about 25 bucks right now. It just came back up um, recently and people are like, oh, why helium? You know, helium is going down. <sighs> helium is getting more and more crowded, I guess you can say. And let me just pull this uh, up. Right now we have 665,000, um, 679 hotspots and it increased by 75,000 over the last 30 days. Yeah, it's getting a little crowded. However, there's plenty of places that don't have hotspots yet. And if you're in a really crowded location, I can understand how you're like, man, I'm not going to get as many rewards as I should. The return on investment is still really, really good when it comes to helium. And like, I can't knock them for that because the, the payouts are pretty darn good. And I'm still going to be mining helium. I'm still going to be getting more miners and deploying more miners. Um, I mean, the next having that's the next. That's the thing you guys got to realize that Rewards are going to get cut in half next year, not this year. You have over a year to earn at the rate that you're currently earning at. And yes, the network has been down. There has been things that have been, you know, less than ideal, I guess you can say. But those things are getting worked on. And overall, at the end of the day, it still pays to mine helium. Um, you know, hotspot prices are lower and lower. And it's just it's just a smart move for you to get in as early as possible so that you can actually make your money back as soon as possible, especially if you don't have a lot of people around you. I mean, when I say a lot, you want to make sure you have some people around you. And if you don't have enough people around you, just buy more miners and deploy them all over. It's so worth it. But keep that in mind, like helium is still worth it. And people, you know, I kind of get slack from people all the time just saying, oh, what are you doing? You know, you're talking about helium. It stinks right now. Like, yeah, I mean, sometimes the network does kind of stink, um, but the rewards are still worth it, even with, you know, less rewards still have more than made my money back on my miner. So highly recommend you guys check out Helium. And I get questions all the time. I have a few videos on like antenna setup and I'll try to put the video link here. Um, but there are other, you know, means for you to learn about Helium as well. And one of them that I actually, this is just a good dude all around. Um, this is Nick. Nick is the man and he was actually voted the like most valuable community member um, last year because he's a good dude. Um, he has some like courses on Helium, which is actually super, super helpful. If you guys really want to dive deep and learn what the heck you need to do to get the best possible returns on this thing, I recommend his, you know, his course. I do have a referral link. I don't even know what the referral link is for, but um, I will put a link. I will put it that yeah, Wait, No, there. I will put it right there. So you guys can go to it. I think I'm going to just make it like grizzlekang.action.ceo. That way you guys can get right to his site and take a look at it. There is a little intro video. If you guys like it, great. If you don't, don't do it. That's OK. But I just want to tell you that I think it has been beneficial um, for me even. Um, he's a wealth of knowledge and just a really good dude all around. He's got a YouTube channel that doesn't nearly get enough views. Um, but yeah, again, I'm not the sole provider of information, so keep that in mind. And that's just project number one. That's helium. Um, something to make mention that I you know, thought about right as I was about to hit record. You can send your helium to crypto.com and this is my crypto.com card. Um, I do have an affiliate link with crypto.com, which gets you guys rewards. 
I love my card and like, I guess this is like a, let me pull this up. That way you guys can actually know what in the world I'm doing with, you know, crypto.com and why I like them. So right now I'm actually get, I'm right here. I'm at the $4,000 mark. It's 3% rewards on anything I spend on my card, which is great. Um, this is the main reason why I like the card. I'm sorry, but with inflation as high as it is, I have to be able to get some kind of return on my savings. And if my savings sits in the bank, it is literally losing money. There's no way a regular savings account can actually get you the returns that you deserve, especially with inflation now. Like if, it's, if inflation's at 7% and you get, let's say 2% return on your you know, uh, savings account, you're losing 5% a year. That's terrible. That's awful. So instead, I have, you know, my savings in crypto now and I get, you know, I want to make sure I'm safe. So right now I get 12% back on my stablecoin. USDC, it's pretty safe for me. And again, it's what I do. Um, and Moto Tech does a really good, you know, video about um, you know, sponsored video by blah, blah, blah. Let me put it, it's this right here. This video is sponsored by crypto.com. But my code is action. So if you guys are signing up for crypto.com, use a coupon code or, you know, referral code action, and that helps the channel. Um, and you know what, I'll, I'll do this. Anything that I make from the Grizzle King or anything that comes in as far as referral goes, I'm going to use that money for what I'm talking about at the very end of the video. So stay tuned for that. Um, it's just a really, really good way for you to not lose money while your money sits. You know, I always talk about this with, you know, in person with people. You want to make sure you get to choose which side of interest you're on. And that goes for credit cards. If you don't pay your credit card in time, well, guess what? You're going to pay interest. But if you have money saved, you're going to earn interest. <sighs> but with inflation, you're losing money even if, it's, if the money just sits there, right? So finding ways for your money to work for you is awesome. And I love this. And yes, I put I, I staked $4,000. You can stake way less than that and still get a good return, but it's worth it in my mind. Um, now, the second project that I wanna talk to you guys about that I actually mentioned on the channel before is actually Nodal. Why Nodal? I'm great. And my stuff stopped working, so I gotta switch it manually, transition. All right, Nodal. There's no price. What's going on? What is this? Well, <laughs> they are not listed, but they are doing some awesome, awesome things. So Nodal is a crowdsourced decentralized IoT network, somewhat similar to what Helium is doing. But instead of using LongFi, they use Bluetooth because, well, your phone has Bluetooth. And the way they're looking at it is instead of making people purchase hardware, let's take advantage of what's already, you know, in people's pockets, their phones. and People have been mining this for a little while now, and they're getting closer and closer to actually getting listed, which means that you're gonna be able to buy and sell tokens, which is awesome. Now, let's talk a little bit more in regards to why I think this is actually a winner. Um, I talked about this a little while back, which was the parachains. So this is the parachain auction, and basically it's not a real auction. You basically put dot um, down, and the, you know, the project with the most dot wins that auction and becomes a parachain. Um, they're already a substrate, and it's an easy switch to a parachain. So substrates, uh, Deeper is a, is a Polkadot substrate. Nodal is a Polkadot substrate. They are basically using the, the Polkadot system to build their infrastructure, but they're not necessarily on the, the, you know, the, the Polkadot relay. Now they are because they want that, um, that parachain auction, which means that security, um, the consensus and validation is all coming from Polkadot, which is awesome for this. Um, and winning a parachain auction is no easy feat. And that's where I think Nodal wins out Helium, at least in the beginning. If you think about it, the hardest, hardest thing for you to do is for you to sell that data. You can get people mining. If you have VCs that are, you know, providing money, like, you know, with Helium, for example, you're getting rewarded based on, you know, other people's money not necessarily how much the network is actually making yet. Nodal has actually implemented a few things that have already been in like the forefront and have already worked. And people have used this for like contact, you know, contact tracing and things like that. So it's not only a platform that works, it's a platform that has been used by people. Um, and finding that sale, like getting the sale of your data to take place is one of the hardest things, um, which reminds me, I'm going to bring you guys a project that is not out yet. 
um let's see if we do it later this week or maybe early next week um it's really awesome because it's like entry entry level for you to be able to like get in at the ground floor um and the thing with that project that i'm going to share with you guys is that they already have a way to sell the data it's not like oh maybe we can find somebody that wants this no, no, no it's the other way around they found how to do the sales first and now they're implementing the data mining aspect of things so it's really awesome you guys are gonna love it but going back to Nodal, um, they won their parachain auction, which means a lot. It means that there's a lot of support behind it. There's a lot of people using it. And this is the next big thing, right? Like you want to get in at the ground floor. And literally, if a project is not listed on an exchange, that's the ground floor. If you can't trade the, the token yet, that is the very, very bottom ground floor that you can get in at. Now, I do have this little piece of info for you guys that the ICO token price 15 cents. You might be going, oh, 15 cents. What does that mean? That's not very much, is it? Like, wh what are we talking here? Helium never did an initial coin offering. However, they did um, like the, the earliest tracking of the token was at 27 cents. So you're talking about early, early with Nodal. Not only that, um, one of the other reasons why I am really into this thing is because of this guy here. So this is one of two nodal gateway miners in the world. And it's made by, no, I'm totally kidding. I just put a sticker on there so that you guys wouldn't see who the manufacturer is. So, and this is actually a really cool thing. Um, you're talking about uh, with this guy, it, it can actually mine about 120 um, nodal cash tokens a month. Um, and that's in just a regular, you know, suburban location. I haven't even placed this where I'm, I'm trying to get this thing like placed in a really, really high traffic location, but it's really good. 120 tokens. If you guys know about Nodo, you can mine that on your phone as well. I got to get you guys a link for the Nodo. I'm going to figure that out. I'm going to put that in, on the video as well. But this Nodo um, miner is going to be exclusively sold with fast miners. And these guys, yeah. 569 for a sense cap m1 is a pretty good deal but these guys are going to be selling this thing and again my goal is to make sure you guys understand that hey you can mine things you can still get products like i would hate to come over here and like hey guys you know what let me talk about cadena you know you you, you should be able to you should mine cadena right now it's really good but you can't get a miner that doesn't do anybody any good but guess what my number three token yeah it's cadena I actually want to tell you guys a little bit about this. And yeah, you can get, where is it at? A KD box with $6,500 right now. I don't even know how many they have, but you know, I think that Kadena is honestly the next big thing. And how do I say this? I am putting my money where my mouth is because I have a KD5 and I have not sold a single token. And I don't plan on selling a single token for a little while. And they just got listed on Binance and i'm just waiting for coinbase to say yeah let's do this let's go and i, I know i'm gonna get a bunch of people going like what, what's cadena what is this thing why is it worth it why does it matter i'm glad you asked so let's take a look at what cadena actually you know is cadena is the answer to the trilemma right and if you guys let me pull up i think i have an image here of the trilemma there we go so there's a trilemma you want things to be scalable, secure, and decentralized. And all of these different blockchains, they solve some, but not all of the issues. So, you know, when it comes to Bitcoin, it's definitely decentralized and secure, but it's slow. It doesn't, you know, it can't do very much. The security, you know, aspect of it is really important to me. And the way that Kadena does it is that it is a proof of work. So it's a POW, not a POS, um, which makes it super secure super super secure so you're mining it with asics just like you would mine bitcoin it's a really good way to keep your network you know uh, up and running in a really really solid way um and you can see like eth 2.0 yeah it's going to be you know both scalable and decentralized but it doesn't have the security of the proof of work aspect of things so it's just solving two you know parts not the security aspect of things so yeah, great. ETH 2.0 is going to be wonderful, but where is the security aspect of things? So that, that, that's where it's missing. And Kadena has been partnering up with other projects uh, like Flux, for example, 
um, you know, Cadena and Flux kind of go hand in hand. And I do love Flux and I should talk to you guys more about Flux. I think Alex from Tactical Investing should be posting a video today about setting up a, a Flux node. Good dude. Um, it is, in my opinion, the next big thing. And people like you have these maximalists talking about Bitcoin is all you ever need. You just use layer two solutions for the stuff. that no, This is a layer one solution that does everything that is just incredible. And if you take a look at and this picture right here. So you're talking about 480,000 transactions per second with 20 chains. And it can keep scaling. They can keep scaling and scaling and scaling. Now, if you take a look at some of the other ones, it's laughable. I think, you know, Bitcoin's at 10. Um, and this is all with a layer one solution. The coolest thing about this is if you look at the time frame, this image was posted on April 13th or yeah, April 12th at the very bottom there. It says April 12th, um, 2021. So if you go to how much Cadena was worth over time, so April 12th, it was at dollar 55 and it's now at six bucks. Yeah, it's it's it peaked out when people finally like, like kind of learned about it and everything. And that $24 mark was a lot of people selling and things like that because they're like, oh my God, this is amazing. Um, and now we just got a little bit of civilization here and it's uh, it's looking good to be honest with you guys. Um, as far as the next big pump, um, this is when they listed on Binance. You can see there's a huge traffic increase. So you have a lot more volume going on. Um, but it is primed to blow up. Um, I don't know if I'm supposed to say this, but Fast Manners is actually working on their own Cadena Miner. And I've been involved as far as getting that stuff set up. And I'm really, really excited to see it come to fruition. Um, and they have a ton of things going on on their you know, ecosystem as well. So with the Cadena ecosystem, this is the uh, uh, Cadex. This is where I actually got this picture. So I just got to give credit where credit's due. Um, these guys were the ones that put this image together. They have a ton of stuff. And I actually talked to them about sponsorship and making a video for them. They were like, yeah, we can give you the tokens. Yeah, no tokens here. I'm just telling you guys about these guys. So Flux. This is what I want to show you. Like Flux is all in. Um, I'm excited to see what UFO gaming comes out. Like they're supposed to come out with some decent fun games. I want to see what that what happens there. Um, one other thing on Kandidan that I do want to highlight is Hypercent. This is going to be awesome because it's the it's the launch pad for Kadena. So this is something you definitely want to you know keep your eye on because it's where you're going to find things that are going to take off. Um, they were doing, you know, an initial launch as well. They decided to not do any VCs or anything like that. They wanted to be all crowdfunded. And, you know, the, the Cadena team is huge. Um, they, you know, stand behind the product that they, they created and the things that they do. So again, it's a really, really good ecosystem that I think is bound to just blow up. So in recap, we got Helium you should be able to get really good rewards you know until next year in august secondly the you know nodal again um nodal miner is going to be coming out shortly um it's i'm really excited about it i want to be able to pick up some of these this is like this is i don't want to even say that this is the the final product this is somewhat of the pro, uh, prototype like i had actually had to do some like in-depth setup for this thing though you know the the final version is almost plug and play um so it's a lot easier for you to set up and last but not least cadena you know um and i've shown you guys asic minor value and how that works and how you can you know basically get a really really good return on your investment when it comes to kda and six bucks is cheap guys six bucks is very very cheap and right now people are talking about it can either go down to four or explode Either way, it's going to go up. It's just a matter of when, right? When is it going to really, really take off? So $4 is going to be really the bottom, bottom of it, the way I'm looking at it. Again, not financial advice telling you guys what I'm doing. I'm not selling this thing, you know, for a long while because I do believe in what they're doing and I know there's a really bright future ahead. I got to put this at the very beginning of the video. All right, drop a comment down below so that I know exactly what mineable token you guys are excited about. That's how you entered the giveaway for one of these great products that I just showed you. So that's it. Um, now I end the video and then we do giveaway. See you guys. All 
right, we are back. Yes, I am giving the Pico away, like I was saying, but I'm also gonna give out other things because you guys know when you watch the video until the very end, you get to hear all the fun, fun stuff, and that's what we do here and now. Transition. This is the video uh, for the giveaway on the Pico. Uh, I already grabbed that URL, and I go here, I plug the URL in, and I go filter duplicate users, and I'm just gonna get YouTube comments. How many we got? I've been cleaning up. All right, 376. That's good because I've been cleaning up crazy, crazy amounts of spam. And it's a pain in the butt, but it happens. But here we go. Johnny5012, for crypto. Love my deeper mini. Awesome, Johnny. Johnny, head on over to the Discord. I am going to, you know, send you a deeper connect mini. Not mini. This is a Pico. What am I talking about? Man, I've been trying to do like. I started recording this video like five times. I'm like, it's got to get it perfect. And I didn't get it perfect. I still had to add stuff. Now, something else that happened on that video is that at the very end, I told you guys to add Deeper Gang to your comment. And I'm going to go ahead and get YouTube comments with the hashtag Deeper Gang. Let's see how many of you guys actually wrote that in. 70 of you. All right. So we'll do giveaways for um, the Deeper bottle opener as well as the deeper keychain we'll do one of each so first one washington hey washington head on over to discord open a ticket and i'll send you one of these and here's how i'll do it um whoever sends me the message first gets to pick which one they want so make sure you open that ticket as soon as you get a chance i'm going to pick one more winner joe joe Come on over to Discord, buddy. You're gonna get one of these, you know, items too. Now, what else did I want to talk to you guys about? Oh yeah, that's right. Transition. Here we go, because my thing isn't working anymore. I promised some of you stickers, and I did not follow through with that because I actually have kind of lost where it was. So what I'm doing? Something special. Um, two things actually, as far as you know, action crypto stickers go. I have opened up a form. If you guys want to get a action crypto sticker and you didn't buy stuff from what do you call it? Uh, Fast Miners. So because well, Fast Miners actually sent them a bunch of stickers and they're sticking it with anybody that uses a coupon code action there. Um, I got a form for you guys and the link to the form is super simple. It's just sticker that action that CEO fill out the form and I will get you a sticker. This is the best way for me to keep track of things because I am just getting lost and lost and lost. And what I had promised is that I was going to give do a giveaway for the, you know, some of the coolest sticker locations that were placed out there in the wild. And I am following through. Ben, I want to make sure that you get the credit for this. So this is just amazing. I couldn't believe when I saw this thing. So yeah, Ben, you're you're getting a hundred bucks in crypto. So just open a ticket on Discord and I'll hook you up, man. Um, I appreciate all the love and support. You guys are phenomenal. Um, I, I was going to say, yeah, make sure you, you don't forget to smash the like button for the YouTube algorithm. But let's be serious. You guys are made it this far. You, you already did that. So I'm not worried one bit. Sorry I was away for a little bit. I got sick, then everybody else in the family got sick, and then I had the other businesses that I run that I had to kind of tend to to make sure that they were doing okay because things pile up, and this got put on the back burner. So what I'm working on is actually making other things more streamlined so that I can give more time and attention to this channel and less time to the other things because I love hanging out with y'all. I love doing these videos and just sharing life and what I'm doing and how I'm doing it with you all. So thank you for the love and support. You guys are phenomenal. I do mean it every time I say it and I'm going to keep saying it because it's so true. You guys are great. I'll see you in the next video. Give me a high five. I am so sorry for the double fake out. This is the first time I've ever do this. Um, I told you guys I would, you know, pick the, the sense cap, the Bobcat or the Kaitera. Um, somebody actually reached out to me and said, why would you ever give a Kaitera out? Those guys blocked you. Um, so we're going to do this. I'm going to do the Bobcat for sure and make sure I take care of you guys. So when you guys are leaving that comment, you're going to get, you know, entered to win that Bobcat. However, here's the catch. Um, and I do want to make sure you guys know about this one. I'm going to give out a Kaitera as soon as Planet Watch unblocks me from Twitter. How about that? Let's make it fun. So as soon as Planet Watch unblocks me from Twitter, I will go ahead and give out, you know, a Sense Edge Mini from Kaitera. How's that sound? Good? Worthwhile coming back? I think so. All right, guys. Take care.